Well, Pep, you could have won it. You possibly could have lost it as well. What are the overriding emotions at the end of that? Uh, pride, because we could have come here with uh, a lot of excuses, but we didn't. I think we attacked the game. Uh, it's a big compliment for the team because the way they fought throughout the whole game was incredible, in my opinion. And um, of course, we can play better. We know this. If we are clear in mind, if we connect the game better, if we, if we, uh, uh, if we sometimes are a little bit more patient to switch the side to have control on their half because it, Chelsea is a team who wants to have the ball. So um, these things we can do better. But the moments we were clear in mind, uh, we created chances, and that's a good thing. Just two players to pick up on at very different ends of the experience spectrum. Mo with another world-class yeah. finish today. And at the other end, Quivine stepped into the breach brilliantly. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's not easy to replace the best goalkeeper in the world. <laughs> but uh, I think we have a lot of faith in Quiv and he showed today why. So that's really important. All the things he has we really like. He's a super shot stopper, but also with his feet, he is calm. And, and that's something we need against teams who press like Chelsea press. Um... And the other thing was? Mo. Mo, yeah. Ah. <laughs> um, what to say? Uh, World-class world player with a world-class attitude. So. Uh, talk to me about the communication through the game. Were, were you able to speak to Jürgen whilst the game was going on? And, and what have you said to him since the final whistle's blown? Yeah. Uh, one, one, um, we were in contact, of course, over the last two days. Um, we prepared the team yesterday. Uh, with everything we had, we tried to keep it as natural as possible for the players, so no, um, uh, so that not th not a lot of things would change. Uh, I think uh, the players accepted and the players did really well. Uh, we had constantly contact, Jurgen and myself, and um, yeah, it was nice to hear in half time that uh, his, his voice and he sounds okay. So, but of course, he should uh, focus on his health and getting better. Thanks, Pat. Cool.